Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and uh, there was a series of microcode updates that have been released by Intel for the famous issues, stability issues and problems of performance degradation on the Intel Core i9, i7 and i5 that is 13th and 14th generation. So here you see the list and this list I'll actually copy and paste it in the description below so you can check out if you're part of the um, updates for the um, microcode. So it fixes basically the problems that are plaguing this series of processors. But the microcode has to go through a BIOS update. And this is where it gets a little complex. You will need to know where to get your BIOS updates. And that means you need to go to the manufacturer of your PC or motherboard that you use if you built your own PC. And there, find the latest BIOS update and apply it according to the instructions of the manufacturer. So it's not for the faint of heart, that's for sure. Uh, you can maybe ask help from somebody that knows a little more about technology um, if you're not sure if you want to do it or how to do it. One thing for sure, it's really important to do it because in certain circumstances, these processors can start um, degrading badly and creating all sorts of problems on your computer because of the wrong voltage being applied. So... Um, if you know you have a Dell PC with those processors, you have to go to the Dell website. There, search for your model of um, a PC. There's uh, often a sticker or a tag with numbers, serial numbers, or whatever, and find the correct BIOS. And whatever manufacturer your PC comes from, an HP, a Dell, a Lenovo, and so on, Acer, um, they should have an update for the BIOS on your machine, your specific machine. And once again, if you're a builder and decided to do your own PC, then you have to go to the manufacturer of the motherboard that you've used. So Asus and so on, uh, depending on the company that uh, made the motherboard. And you will have to, of course, flash the BIOS uh, according to the manufacturer instructions. So the list of the CPUs is in the description below if you want to compare if it's, you're, you're in it. Remember, it's 13th and 14th generation only. I get all of these posts of people saying, oh, I got this or that. Is, is it in that problem? And, and they are not the 13th or 14th gen. Remember, 13th gen, 14th gen, the number of the CPU is, starts with a 13 uh, or, or a uh, 14 and make sure that you uh, update. If you your your processor number um, doesn't start with a 13 or 14, you're not concerned at all with the problems that they're having on Intel CPUs right now. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.